district attorney is considering whether to charge the owner of the Blue Cove Hideaway in McMinn County after a drowning occurred there over the weekend. This is the second drowning at the same place in the past year. Stephanie Sanastasi joins us now live to tell us what the owner has to say. Stephanie. Kevin Latricia, this right here is the wooden plank where the owners say a 25 year old Atlanta man jumped off yesterday. Now the man signed a form once he got here waiving the owner of any responsibilities, but the sheriff says this place has got to go. The owner, Charles Womack, says he's not going anywhere. I just trying to help uh, these high school kids and college kids because they ain't got no money. You don't put no lifeguard in the lake. And when I had a lifeguard, might have been way over here, and that's. Probably two or three thousand feet up there when something happens in. No, I ain't putting no lifeguards. District Attorney Stephen Crum says he is reviewing this drowning death to see if any criminal charges will apply to the owner. He says he'll try to co complete that review as quick as he can. For now, reporting live in McMinn County, Stephanie Sanastasi, News Channel 9.